Yes, as a huge Negan fan, I think this is absolutely awesome because we get to look at this two different ways. We get to enjoy it live on TV, and then when the Blu-ray comes out, we can actually enjoy a more comic authentic version of Negan minus that fucking beard. Welcome to Make a Path Presents. I'm Ronnie Hayes, and today let's talk about Negan and the F-bombs. This is going to be a quick little video and Entertainment Weekly, please do not flag or block this damn video. Entertainment Weekly is coming out with a new cover and I guess during the photo shoot, photo shoot, <laughs> photo shoot, they interviewed or did a mini interview with Jeffrey Dean Morgan about Negan. Now he does say they're in the seventh episode about the time they did this photo shoot and he's still got the full beard so if you don't like the beard you're fucking stuck with it <laughs> uh, and then they go into discussing how many curse words he has said in filming and it, it, Jeffrey Dean Morgan says something that made my day here it is now what we do with Negan is we have to film a TV version and I still am allowed a couple swear words I can drop them in there and here and there and then we do what we call the F take uh, where I just let loose. Alright so yes as a huge Negan fan I think this is absolutely awesome because we get to look at this two different ways. We get to enjoy it live on TV and then when the Blu-ray comes out we can actually enjoy a more comic authentic version of Negan minus that fucking beard but we get to enjoy you know the foul mouth the Negan and I know there's a couple comments where people are like what's the big deal you know it doesn't yada yada you know people have different tastes you know and I would actually prefer a more authentic Negan and if they're gonna go through the trouble of filming this multiple different ways and then releasing it so we can enjoy the Negan from the comic book and then also you know get it on screen I don't know two different ways I it's it's just perfect in my opinion you guys know uh, previously I suggested just muting the damn curse words and giving it to us on blu-ray well I'm happy now because either mute it or you know give us an unmuted version an unsent or a censored version on TV and then afterwards when the blu-ray comes we can experience it you know f-bombs and all even maybe slightly different dialogue a slightly different performance keep in mind it's not just gonna be them inserting random f-words every now and then you're gonna get you know a different expression a different slight subtle slight differences I'm not saying his whole performance is gonna be uh, very different but it's gonna be enough to where it should be a refreshing rewatch of the Negan scenes and I am so thrilled and so very excited about that we're gonna get a better example of this when the season six um, the season six blu-ray comes out so we're gonna be able to really shortly in a couple months buy season six on blu-ray put it into the TV watch this new uncensored scene in the finale the Negan introduction and that should give us a clear taste of what re-watching season seven will be like when season seven gets released on blu-ray and we could take it home and watch these scenes but the season six blu-ray should definitely give us a little sneak peek into what that's going to be like this is very exciting i am thrilled now i do not believe they're going to do this for every single little scene maybe even just the big scenes maybe the scenes where he's pissed or where he's very expressive you know dropping those f-bombs dropping all kinds of curses because if it's uncensored truly he can say pretty much whatever he wants and this is even more exciting because look at now when you go back and rewatch it when you get it on blu-ray and bring it home it's totally refreshing because they're not just inserting curse words you know he's refilming these scenes so it's going to be new expressions it might have a slight subtle difference i'm not saying they're going to film it completely different with different camera angles and all that but Jeffrey Dean Morgan's performance, his expressions, will be different. Again, they'll, it'll be different takes, completely different takes. Not only that, not only do we get to re-watch this in a slightly new, refreshing way, but some of the most iconic quotes from the comic, the ones we know have words you could never have on TV, we are getting them most likely. They're, listen, they're not going to film this twice and pass up on some of the most iconic, you know, Negan scenes. And I can't wait for Jeffrey D. Morgan to say shit like how Negan says, fuckity fucking fuck. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait for his 
performance, that aspect, and a ton of different quotes that I can run down a list where every single word except for one or two, like the and with, every other word is a curse word. But it's not just the fact that he's saying curse words, you know, because I know we'll get a couple comments. Only 12-year-olds just want to hear. It's not about hearing the curses. No, 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 no. It's about, you know, his way of expressing himself with sometimes maybe so bottled up with anger and just letting it out to where he has no other words but different variations of fuck. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? And then immediately after that, he could be angrier. He could be completely calm, <laughs> you know? And it's all how he's saying it. Sometimes he lets off with a barrage of curse words and it actually chills him out. Afterwards, he's like, okay, he vented. You know, that's his meditation. Let's move on to the next thing. Sometimes that's just how he thinks, how he concentrates, how he plays around, um, how he shows affection. The curse words are used so abundantly, and they mean so many different things at so many different times. So it's not just the word itself. You know, it's not, fuck, we can hear that word anywhere. It's not a big deal. It's Negan's performance as a character coming to life off the comic book page onto the small screen and I'm thrilled and I'm so thankful and grateful that they're giving this to the fans and that's only a piece of the mini interview if you want to find out more I'm gonna put a link down below you can watch the full interview and then you can get all the information in case you want to pick up this entertainment weekly with Negan on the cover I love this I'm gonna shut up find more information at the Entertainment Weekly's link I'm gonna put down in that description. Now it's your turn to give me your thoughts and opinions about this topic down in that comment box. I'm done talking, it's your turn. Subscribe now.